Hey everyone, welcome to yet another video by WHO Productions. So today we will be seeing how we can make this uh, handwritten text effects uh, in After Effects. And it's a really simple method, uh, but it is uh, extremely useful uh, when you are making your intros or animations or title screens. So all of this will be done in After Effects without any plugins. And uh, if you are new to the channel, then please subscribe for more amazing content and let's get straight to the video. So for this effect, we are going to jump straight into After Effects and uh, let's just go ahead and type something over here with this uh, type tool. So you can type anything that you want. Let me just uh, go ahead and type something. So you can just go ahead and uh, center line this within your uh, screen uh, by using the line options. And uh, it's good if you use a, a script font. Uh, and you can use any script font that you like. So basically what we are going to do is just going to click this and uh, then go ahead and select our pen tool. We are going to trace uh, this uh, all this all these wording over here, uh, but it's not going to uh, be perfect. Uh, so it won't take too much time and you can just uh, go ahead and simply do this. Uh, if you start from over here, then just go ahead and make sure that you cover uh, the stroke from within just like so. And as I'm going to do this, I'm just going to go ahead and also use these if I want to make a sharp turn like just like this and add it over here. So once I need to uh, move to another spelling, uh, let's suppose uh, C over here is not joined by S. So I'm just going to click once over here, then click this once again, and then go ahead and apply this mask pen tool once again just so I have a uniform stroke over here and this is extremely simple you don't have to uh, just make it uh, too much perfect but uh, it's good if you make it a little bit fine just like how I am doing right now and for this dot over here you can just go ahead and select uh, this top over here and then for this I'm just going to go ahead and do this because this dot is also going to be covered within the stroke. So once I finish this, I'm going to get back. So I've done all of my uh, stroke uh, over here. And as you can see, I have this. Uh, you can turn it on or off or just by clicking this button over here. Now what I'm going to do is uh, just go ahead and select layer, sorry, effect. And in the generate section, I'm going to just select the stroke effect. So I'm going to select uh, uh, all masks over here because I want to apply the stroke to all of the masks and check this as reveal original image. I'm going to just select the end as zero. And what I'm going to do next is uh, just uh, change the brush size to let's suppose 15 or somewhere around whatever you like uh, you think is the best. So I'm just going to animate this end section over here as zero. And then at two seconds, let's say I'm going to go back to 100 over here so th what this is going to do is this is going to animate this stroke over here so if you want to make this even finer then you can make this fine but this one is extremely really nice if you want to make uh, those intros so you can basically just experiment with this uh, stroke uh, brush size like i said before and you can uh, make this finer now once i've selected uh, 10 from over here instead of 15 then i've uh, made it a little finer and the strokes that were visible before have vanished as you can see so guys i hope you liked this video and if you did then please leave a like comment below on where you have used this effect if you like this and a lot of you haven't subscribed so please be sure to do so for more amazing content like this and i'll see you guys in the next one inshallah